The inventors of a one-of-a-kind aircraft want to use the spaceport to make history. The problem, they say the spaceport and the FAA are ignoring them. And as News 13's Emily Younger reports, New Mexico may lose out because of it. It's infuriating. It's frustrating. Lester Haynes' feelings are strong. It's just, just sitting around waiting. For five years, Haynes and his brig counterparts have worked tirelessly to perfect the first ever rocket powered 3D printed aircraft known as the Vulture 2. The aircraft is attached to a helium filled balloon. Once the team shoots it into the sky, they fire the rocket motor inside. The balloon bursts, and it then flies itself automatically back to the ground. What could possibly go wrong? Very simple. Not exactly. The team out of the United Kingdom was supposed to launch in Spain. When that didn't work out, they moved their project to Spaceport America here in New Mexico. That was a year ago. They agreed in principle. We actually went down to, to meet them, and that was the last we ever heard of it. Haynes says the spaceport told him he had to get approval for the project from the FAA. He says he sent in his paperwork 12 months ago. Basically what's happened is they've, they've gone completely silent. Both Spaceport America and the FAA have gone completely silent. He says his crew has called about their project status time and time again, but there's never been an answer. We tried this week for ourselves. The spaceport sent us a statement saying it can't move forward with the project until the FAA approves the Vulture 2. Hi, this is Emily Younger with Channel 13 here in Albuquerque. We called the FAA on Thursday and still haven't heard back. It's something Haynes says he and his crew are fed up with. He says if they don't hear back from the FAA or Spaceport soon, he'll move the project from New Mexico to Colorado. Once you start something, you think, right, well, well obviously we've got to finish it. It's just totally unnecessary to be held up like this. Emily Younger, KRQE News 13. This is the same crew that set the Guinness World Record for highest launch of a paper plane five years ago. UNM says it'll start